So someone wrote in and said, it was a really loving letter. Um, they said that their child is in college, first year of college, doing great, where they were so proud of their, their kid. Um, but the person, their, their child is dealing with gen trying to figure out what, what they want in terms of gender. They've taken a sexuality course, they're questioning, they're feeling gender fluid. Mm -hmm. And their parents, the parents are super loving and supportive and they're wanting to know what do we do? How do we support? Um, how do we help take care of this? That sort of thing. So they came to us. Yes. I'm Reed Nahalko from ReadAboutSex.com. I'm Kathy Bartulli from TheIntimacyDojo.com. And we're actually not the best people to ask because we're pretty cisgendered in yeah. how we identify with the world. Yeah. Cisgendered meaning you're the, if you've never thought about or questioned which bathroom you should be using when you're out in public, mm -hmm. then you're probably cisgendered, which means that the gender that was assigned to you at birth is the one that seems to fit best for you. Yes. And now that we live in the day and age where people are deconstructing gender and, and you can be gender fluid, you can be gender queer, you can be trans, you can be this, you can be that. Um, now it's all up for grabs and some people have kids or friends who are going through this and you're like, ah, what do I do? How do I do this right? Yes. So we will point you in good directions for resources, but understand that we're just two cisgendered people here sitting in front of a video camera. Yeah, and we really appreciate you asking the question because a lot of parents would be so overwhelmed with that situation mm -hmm. and they wouldn't even think to ask how they could support their child. So thanks for being awesome parents. Yeah. So the first thing is I would just encourage you. I, I'm just, again, cisgendered, but I know when I came out as, as a lesbian initially and later as bisexual, um, having someone, my grandfather actually was amazing about this. Mm -hmm. Um, I brought my girlfriend home and I said, you know, are you guys okay? And he said, you're still my granddaughter, right? Like, I love you just as you are. You get to be who you are. And so knowing that was so reassuring. So just telling your, your child, like, hey, I know this is a confusing time right now. You're trying to figure out a lot. And society can be really challenging around this. And I want you to know I love you and I support you and I'm going to be there for you as you figure this out, and it's okay if you're not certain, it's okay if you change your mind, I'm just going to love you. Mm. So in just being really clear about that, and it can be challenging, so I encourage you to get some support, because most of us were brought up in a society where you were either, it's a very binary society, you were either male or female, and that's it. Yeah. Um, and I know very loving people <coughs> who've been very challenged. Yeah by the concept that people can be gender fluid. Mm -hmm. So, you know, get some support for yourself if you can, even if you're, you know, intellectually you understand all of this, yeah. like you may. Kate Bornstein's um, Gender Outlaws book is a great book for, for everybody, and there are lots of other books out there, but I would start there. Um, Alex Morgan as a trans person, um, Ignacio Rivera is great with gender and talking about trans issues and gender issues. Um, and I'm sure I'm forgetting a ton of other amazing people, but start there with those people. A Mac, um... <coughs> ah, Mac McGregor yeah. in Seattle. Yeah. Um, other really great people. Um, if you need their, you know, can't find them on Twitter or whatnot, you can just write in the comments. And we'll help you um, find them. And we'll help you find them. We'll try to put them in the uh, in the description below. Yeah. So yeah, if you can, just let you know. Keep doing such a great job and get the support you need. And let you know your kid know you love them, and that's yep. that's a big step forward. Regardless of what gender you are, how you identify, or where you are in the spectrum, people just like to be loved. loved. Mm -hmm. Thanks, Thanks for so writing much. in. Comments below. Resources. List yours. Yeah, share, please.